Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today, slowing the pace, doing a little bit of pond fishing. On some private property over in Charles County, a fishing club that I belong to. We've got largemouth, we've got snakehead, with all kinds of fish over here. You may have seen the ponds featured in a, some previous videos. I got a little overcast skies today, should be good for the fishing. So y'all stick around, we're gonna put some fish in the boat. Oh. Never dismiss the pickerel if you are bass fishing. It can let you know what you're throwing is something that's gonna work. Sure, they're slimy, wiry, and we would all much rather long distance release one, but they are a good sign you're doing something right. For me, pond fishing is some of the purest fishing out there. I guess that comes from my childhood. It's how I cut my teeth fishing. I really don't remember a time that my brothers and I didn't fish. I couldn't even tell you what my first rod was, but I'm sure it was a beat up hand-me-down that barely worked, but that also caught a lot of fish. This day was pretty typical. The bite was non-existent until the evening time when the shadows begin to get long. Then, game on. I find it interesting how one day a bait is absolutely on it and will slay the fish. And the next, you don't get a bump. Today's bait, a yellow and white chatter bait. I threw worms, jerk baits, spinner baits, flukes, Pretty much all of the usual suspects, but the chatterbait is what put the fish in the boat. I guess it could be a combination of whatever bait you're throwing when the bite turns on, but I believe you need to be throwing the right bait when the bite turns on. I practice using my bump board now even when I know the fish won't or in today's instance can't score. Practice makes perfect and the fish do love the flop. So every fish I get to put on the board, I give it a go. Yep. That's not what swirled that bait though. No. But whatever did, this it got his attention. And he came over to see what was going on and he ended up with my bait in his mouth. Oh yeah. What about I'ma call it a 13 incher. Healthy. 
Ooh, we stretch you out to 14, buddy. 14, 14, and he gone. <laughs> Fish on. Today saw some nice fish and it was time well spent. I hope you enjoyed fishing with me today. And if you haven't already done so, please take a minute, click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching everybody. Tight lines. <laughs>